Right, hello and welcome to uh, episode 18 of Half Moon Bay. We're here in, well, it's currently called Burton Basin. If anybody's got other ideas for names, let me know. Um, and I've just been looking at the way that this intersection works, and I don't terribly like it. Um, I think what I'm going to do here is we're going to we're going to start this episode by redoing this. Because I don't like the way that it goes. I mean, I kind of do, but I mostly don't. <laughs> so let's see. I can probably back this road off some, too. Like to here. Uh, one lane ramp. Curvy road. Can we go from like here? There we go. Then at least we can get a little bit more room on this one. Yeah, that should help. We can back this one up too. So turning in from here, let's get this all set up here. Where's my two-lane freeway ramp? We want this to come basically from as close as we can to here. Something like that. Although I'd kind of like it to start more, more like back here. Okay. And then, <coughs> excuse me. And then we need a way for people going this way to get over here. So we need this. What do you mean road grade too steep? Okay. Oh, and I forgot time was running, so we need to run time a little farther here so we can get, uh, get back to daylight. Let's see. We need this to come across here. Oh, wait. We need the elevated, though. Why does it say road grade too steep? It looks rather flat to me. filter is so dark. I mean, it looks so good at night, but it's just, it's so dark. There must be a little bit of terrain variation there that I'm not able to see right now. Let's try it from out just a little bit. First of all, we're going to need to go this way. And secondly, we're going to need 
need to be a little bit farther out. Oh, there was a spot right there. Let me get a little bit closer to this. right about there is all we're going to get. Cannot intersect this road. Why can you not intersect this road? Mm, okay, so that's not good. I'm not sure what's going on there. Oh, and we're back in daylight, so let's pause things. Why not? Because that's exactly what I want here. Okay. I suppose we're going to need to redraw this little part here and then just connect straight in to this other ramp. That's weird that it won't let me connect that intersection. But that's okay. We will find another way. So here, if we're going to do it that way, let's go like this. From right about here. Let's, see, let's go like that. Gonna be a little farther out. And I think we need to be a little bit more shallow too. Yeah, there we go. Oh, and this has to be a little longer. Let's see. There. Let's try that. Man, come on. Such a pain in the ass. <laughs> I guess we have to do it from over here. So it has enough room to come out. had a spot before. Let's try. <laughs> All right, let's try this again. See, like that looks like it should work, but it's giving me angle too sharp. So, what if we do this? Let's go from like here. Give it a less sharp angle. Seriously, this is this is getting tedious. Like this was fun for a second, but now it's now it's getting annoying. I had, I had it. Okay, what if we do this? There we go. Alright, 
right, so we do that. And then we do this. We bulldoze all of this. And hopefully I can get this to draw back in the way that I want it to. Except that it's not wanting to connect in the way that I want it to. Okay, maybe I have to do this. Hmm. I did not want these roads to be this tedious this early in the morning. Yes, it's a little before 9 a.m. my time. Try this again. I will eventually get this stupid thing to work. I'd really love it if I could get it to work. Going this way. We have to come from farther this way. Hey, there we go. Let's do that. That will work. And then this one, this one is still going to need to go like way over here because we have no other way of doing it. And what I'd really like to do is, and I, I don't think I'm going to be able to though, Let's take it from right over here and go all the way around. Yeah, and I don't. Oh, hang on. If I were to hit the right keys, this might work. <coughs> That's a better angle. Well, not really. There we go. Let's see if we can find a good spot for it. Right there. Right there. And then that merges on. There. That's that's a bit cleaner looking of an intersection there. Mostly cleaner. Now let's figure out what to do with this end. I think we might just hook it in 
to this road down here. Do off ramps uh, from the sides like this. Let's see here. Two lane freeway ramp. Um, this side goes this way, so it needs to go like this. This side, I want the raised one because we're going to go <laughs> like this. And then transition down. That's right, that's what I did. And of course we're going the wrong direction here. Because this one goes in, and this one we need to come out. This is going to be the elevated part. Mm, a little too close. There we go. And then over here we just transition down. To like right there. And then merge in. Yeah, that should work. Weird, fun intersection. We have just a lot of demand <coughs> in general. <laughs> and I think we're going to increase the wealth level as we go back. So up here in the front is where we're going to have our low wealth stuff. I would kind of like to smooth this out a little. Let's angle this curve more. We're not angled, but curve the curve? I don't know. <laughs> that looks a little bit nicer, except for this part. There's a little, there's a weird lump there. There, that's a little better. So let's figure out how we're gonna um, put people in here. So I'm not sure what I wanna do with this area yet. Cause I could do something different in here. Even maybe some touristy stuff, like a small tourist and gambling thing. I'm not, I'm not sure. Well, 
We'll see here. We've got time. We'll figure it out. I'm kind of looking at this and wondering if I can reduce its size a little. Let's try it. Let's give it a shot. Yeah, see that that'll work totally fine. Let me reduce its size by quite a bit. It's a funny looking intersection, but I like it. I think it's neat. Um, okay, let's start let's start building some stuff for people to live in, because we need to we need to get our academy going, so we can start building on to onto that. Um, so I think what I want to do here is have one central. Let's see, now these are all raised, so I can connect some streets underneath okay let's have one of these come down like oh, do I not have any straight down angles? damn that sucks hmm <laughs> I would have thought that I would have had an angle straight down. What if I do it this way? That could actually work really nice. There we go. Now let's find our distance here. Um, what am I looking for? Oh, I'm in the wrong menu. There we go. And I think I'm only going to do one building of distance because I want some streets in here. I want them to have a little bit more places to go. don't think we're going to connect that one. But it should too close to existing intersection. Oh, because that's on the ground. Okay. So we can't go underneath there. And we'll do another one here. Another line. I think we will connect this one. Of course, yeah, we won't be able to make it through there. And we can do one on this side, which we won't be connecting. can go in through there if we need to. And I think we'll do one more on this side that's connected. through no but we can go underneath if we need 
And then we'll do one more on this side that is not connected. That way we limit the amount of um, <coughs> the amount of intersections on our main avenue here. We need this. How many buildings I'm going to be able to fit in each spot? Well, that's a bit more difficult of a proposition here. I'm not entirely sure how I'm going to do it. I suppose I can take a road that goes like straight across the back of here and start from there. work as a starting point. And I think we'll do lengths of th two? Just do two. Why not? see where two is over here, but I don't think we'll need to draw anything. Hmm. Yeah, I don't really want to cross that street like that. That out. That out. I'll round some corners and stuff in a little bit. Um. I just want to figure out where we're where we're going with all this first. So then this one could actually come out. Oh, it's too close to actually intersect, but we can we can use it as the starting point for the ones over here. Even though there's not going to be that many over here. If it works out, these can all connect. Look at that. Awesome. I love using the, the stuff underneath the, t the bridges. Which means if we do two from this side, where will we be? I shouldn't have another one coming down here. Hmm. Yeah, I don't think I actually want to do anything with that, but I am going to use this as a uh, start uh, as a marker. There we go. Because then we can go this way with these. And that one, of course, will be the one that doesn't touch. There we go. And then we can grow stuff on this side. And the width, I think, is going to be this way. Let's see which way are we facing those? This way. So let's do... Yeah, let's do this way. 
That way we're kinda, like, these, these will be faced one way, these will be faced the same way, just 180 degrees, and the same with these, but these will be at 90 degree angles to these two. As far as the way that the buildings, the length and the width and stuff. You'll see what I, well, you'll see what I'm talking about. I'm babbling. This one will connect and can go up to like there. This one will not connect and it will go. Uh, I can go up to there. This one will connect. Connect it to. Too far. Hey. Hey. <laughs> figure out the horizontal part for this one. I think we just take the, the farthest one out here. And just do this. Uh, except that it doesn't like that. How about that? That ought to work. I don't think we'll need it, but just in case I need something over here. Let's see here. If I do two... Alright. Let's do two here. Hello, M Amin Daz, Amy N Daz. <laughs> I don't, I don't know. One of those. How are you doing today? In this city, I think I am gonna leave four-way intersections um, in the middles, just because I want to encourage people to really go around the outside. on the end if I can. Go. Bring this in. <laughs> well, I'm glad you're you're liking watching it so far. All right, so this part I need to find. Oh, there's a problem with my plan. It won't work. <laughs> that's, that's the problem with my plan. Because the... Oh, thank you, Amy. I'm glad you like the intersections. So there's a problem with my plan here. And that problem is that I had planned to do this part with the long air way going this way. But I can't do that. Because of the because of the way that this is faced. Damn. Oh, maybe I'll do four by four intersections. I'll do large ones. That's what we'll do here. So then let's connect 
this one. And not that one. And then put this in here. Get another one of those going. Probably don't connect this one. Hey, Death Squall. Uh, the ramps like that. I imagine you're, you're asking how to get um, how to do one-way roads like that, and that's um, that's a mod called Udon. It's a unidirectional road network. Um, there's a there's a it's one of the top mods on Simtropolis if you go there. Or there's also um, if you go to my website tinvec.com, it's it's listed in the SimCity mods I love post. It's top like I don't know first or second post or something. Yeah, Amy, this uh, these small streets are going to be um, well, they're not really that small. They're high density streets, but uh, they're going to be yeah the, the inside the city kind of move around, get to your house sort of deal. <laughs> well, Amy, um, the most I can do to teach you is show you, and, and you're already doing that, so. Let's see, and I think I would rather have this one intersect, because it's farther away. Because if I put this one here, those two get really close. So let's leave that out. And bring this up to, like, here. And then see where we're at back here for room. And go a little closer. Ooh, nice. And then I suppose we should take this one. About as far that way as we can. Let's see where we can get to over here. Yeah, I thought we might be pretty close. I don't think we're going to be able to draw a road in there. Like, at all. Yeah, not one that I would want to use. Okay. All right, so we got to start to this inner road network. I don't think we need this little guy, or this little guy, or this little guy. I wonder if it would work well to do something like hmm where do we have room to do this nowhere <laughs> um, I was thinking about doing something like this if I took a like curved road and drop back in and then if I could sink it but I, I don't think I can not enough anyway so the same problem here and I, I can't go up enough it's too close to stuff. Hey, that rhymed. <laughs> um, mm, let's try, what about doing this connection? That on oh, road read too steep. Mm, okay, I guess we're not going to be able to do anything in there. That sucks. But that's okay. And you know what, let's take this one out. I don't want to just do a line there. And this one probably looked better without it in there. Those we'll use. This one we can take out. 
Okay. So let's start zoning. Let's get this. Oh wait, we have. Uh, see, forgot something. Um, <laughs> we need uh, we need like police and stuff. And power. Well, I guess we're getting enough power from the region. And actually, speaking of, just a moment. I'm gonna run and grab more coffee. I need more power. All right, and I'm back with my delicious life's blood. Coffee. Okay. <laughs> so we do have quite a lot of room in this city. I'm thinking about putting in an extra solar power plant for just to help out the other one for now. So let's let's do that with this area down here. Let's actually let's do it like this. Now we have power. Water, we should be able to get plenty from the region to get started. And there's lots of water in here. I mean, I suppose we can use this for our utilities, actually, now that I'm thinking about how everything is placed here. So let's do this. Let's put this here. And then we'll put the sewage treatment in the middle. Kinda like this. There. We're gonna let the other city take care of our trash and our recycling. So now we just need to do a fire station, which I'm thinking we'll put right over here. I kind of want to put all the services on this outer circular road, so I think that they'll work better that way. We're also going to need a hospital. Well, I guess maybe we can't put it out there. Could actually be really good to put put it like right in here. Or under the bridge a little? Uh. I'm not sure here. Thought I would have more room on the outsides of things. 
But I guess we could put it just, you know, down here too. Yeah, let's put it right here. I'm thinking the police should actually live, like, right over here somewhere. Uh, Vinyl, the, uh, the mod for the roads is called Udon, U-D-O-N, the Unidirectional Road Network. It's one of the top mods on Simtropolis, and, um, if you go to my website, tinvec.com, I have a link there if you, if you can't find it on Simtropolis. We got some services. Now let's think about education here. Our other city has our university, but travel and education don't really work that well. So I'm wondering if I shouldn't do something over here, or maybe even up here with the university. Although we could do, we could really just do a community college in this city. I think we'll do that. But let's put the community college somewhere, somewhere that I like. I kind of, I kind of do want to put it up here. So maybe that's what I'll do. I'll do this. And I wonder if I can draw like a smooth road that goes. Oh, maybe it wants to tunnel that. Oh, that's too much. Too much again. There we go. That's about what I'm looking for. Because then I'll take that over here. And actually, alright, let's do it this way. Yeah, I figured that might do that. Give me this little weirdness on the hill there. <coughs> let's take let's take this out to here. Oh man. Alright, I'm gonna have to redraw this too. Damn it. I hate that it doesn't do nice smooth roads on hills like that. Like as far as you can't go back and edit them. Because <laughs> then what I think I'm going to do here is something like this. And then... 
take that out and connect it. And then this would go something like here. And then it could actually come down. Alright, I guess we actually need this to stay up here a little bit more. There we go. Now we can get down to this other area smoothly. And of course it doesn't want to make a nice intersection. That's okay. Education's going up here. In fact, we'll put it back here. So we can use something, do something else with the upper part. Yep, and those will fit perfectly. Perfectly nice. Okay, that's all of that. Let's put some bus stops in. We know that this is going to be low wealth down here and this is going to be higher wealth back here. So let's put most of the bus stops in down here. And we should actually take this road out. Oops. There we go. And then I don't know that I even want to put any buses back here. We'll put some, I mean, I'll put some park and rides in here. Because actually I wanted to put a whole bunch of park and rides up here. like that. And then we'll put a couple bus stops in here for like people working and stuff. And one for the hospital, because people need to get to the hospital. And one up here. Oh, and one over here. Okay. So now let's zone some people. And we're going to need some commercial for low wealth too, from the other city. So let's make this part commercial. And then pretty much the rest of this residential. And really, I should only draw this where I know full buildings are going to go. And, okay, I guess maybe not. Something like that, I guess. And to minimize the intersection issues. I should put these down to medium. And then this one needs to be medium. And this should be medium, 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 and then we're going to leave all of these high wealth, or high, high density rather. Huh. Has up and down grades for those, interesting. S 
So then let's dezone that because we only want high wall or high density really to fit in. And then let's zone this the rest of this stuff. And on the ones that connect, I will basically just not zone the last a little bit there. I don't think we even want any at all there. So there's our low wealth people. Let's start growing them in as we get to the end of this episode. We'll speed a long time. And then we'll start seeing everybody come in from like ferries and trains and all that fun stuff. And through the road, obviously, we can see everybody going where they need to go. No, you know what I never did? Alright, I gotta pause time here. I never connected this right hand turn. I, I forgot about that. Yeah, let's just have it go straight into here. Then people are hopefully going where they where they want to a little bit easier. And really this oh, I kinda want the four way stop there or the stop lights at those intersections getting out. We got a lot of train activity here. Everyone's coming into the city. Well, I guess we can start a research project here. But it's coming along. Hmm. Never put down Holland. Uh, no, Amy, this is not sandbox mode. I just made a whole bunch of money from my other city and sent it here. Yeah, let's put Town Hall up here for now. Let's see. We, oh, we just had the Department of Education? Okay. Oh, thank you, Amy. Yeah, the other city over here is the one. It's an electronics city, so it made a ton of money. <laughs> I, and I sent, I basically sent ten million to every city that was uh, in in the region. You can see we got our little ferry system going pretty nicely.
Yeah, Amy, I'll, if you care to watch that one get built or anything, uh, that's all up on YouTube. Uh, it should be highlighted here on, on Twitch as well. Um, <clears throat> I believe the first uh, 10 or so episodes, maybe 15, were that city. The, the first 10 or 15 episodes of, of this season, or of this series, rather. Uh, actually, uh, R.I.P. Brothers B, <laughs> I, I do plan to do that, um, in a different, I was thinking I would do a smaller thing in, like, this city or this city, um, I'm not sure yet, but I, I what I kind of want to do is a growth to the middle city, so that there's, like, really only, you know, five or ten high density buildings in the middle and then it's medium kind of surrounding that and then low wealth you know in the outer or not low wealth, low low density in the outer areas i definitely want to do something like that um i just need to i, I really need to bump up the population in this city so so this is this or in this region so this is going to be like a population city basically um let's see how are we doing here with work is it yeah we're not commuting a lot of stuff yet or shoppers uh, this region is the um, Edgewater Bay region, and it's got seven cities. Um, what's that? What's that movie? Seven Brides for Seven Brothers or something? <laughs> but no, it's got seven cities um, and a great work which I made in Arcology because you know I, I want the benefits from shoppers and stuff. Got all these guys going to the ferry terminal. Oh, you're just thinking medium and low with no with no high density at all. Yeah, it's definitely something I will consider. Um, I, th there's seven cities here, so I, I definitely have a lot I can do, <laughs> you know, with with the area. Let's see, yeah, 1,100, well, almost 1,200 riders a day on trains. Good. Not so many on boats, but that's okay. And of course, this city isn't really making money yet. But that's not a big deal. We can put the taxes up so that we will make money when it gets to be that time. But there's just not a lot in the city right now. And it looks like we're about at the end of our time for this episode. Uh, we're at our hour mark. So I hope you've enjoyed watching. Uh, if you're watching live, I will do another one in just a, a few minutes. I'm going to take a quick break and uh, maybe grab a snack this morning. Um, but I will I will do another episode pretty quick here today. So like I said, if, you're, if you like watching me live, you can follow me on twitch.tv slash tinbeck and uh, you know, be notified when I go live and all that fun stuff. I also put most of this stuff up on YouTube after the fact, so uh, youtube.com slash tinbeck has all that stuff as well. Um, of course, there's all, that's, all this is listed up on my website, tinbeck.com. So, uh, yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed, and I hope you enjoy some more when I do some more in a little bit. <laughs> all right, uh, thanks for watching.